These are all seventh chords. Here is F major seven. This is also F major seven, but it is inverted. F major seven over A, first inversion. This is F major seven over C. You'll notice they all have the same notes, just in different order. The lowest note or the bass note is important with inversions. F major seven over E. It looks like we're in the key of F major, so we're gonna write for the function that this is the one chord and the seventh is present. If we didn't have the seven, it would just be a triad. Now we're going to express a seventh chord first inversion, and that's going to be six five. What is six five? From the bass, the lowest note, this interval is a sixth, this interval is a fifth, six five. Relative to the bass, it's telling us where we can find the tonic and the seventh, where those kind of hinge together. Same thing here, it's a one chord, but now we found our tonic and seventh, which is a fourth from the bass and a third from the bass. So this is four, three. And here our tonic and seventh is right at the bottom because we're in third inversion. So we just need to write a two because that's interval of a second. So we have seven, six, five, four, three, two.